Hello, good morning! How are you today, my little explorers? I hope you're doing well. Today, I'm very excited to start the lesson because we're going to talk about something very interesting. And we're going to explore new things. So, let's get started. So, everyone, what is the day and what is the date? Excellent! Today is Thursday. Wow! It's weekend. Okay, so everyone, I can say that you can enjoy your time starting from today because I know that in this week you have three unit tests. So you can have some rest, okay, and do something fun. And the date is June 4, 2020. So I want you everyone now to get your science book because we're going to use it. Grab some pencils and come back. The lesson of today will be about one of the quick changes that happens to Earth's landscape. In the previous lessons, we have learned about the quick and slow changes that happen to Earth's landscape. And today we're going to talk about one of the quick changes, okay, that happens to Earth's landscape. So we call this quick change landslides. We call it landslides. So everyone, let's start our lesson for today and explore what are landslides? So everyone, by the end of the lesson, you will be able to identify the quick changes on Earth's surface. And also you can explain how a landslide may change Earth's landscape. And here we go everyone, there are two links, so please watch the two videos about landslides. Okay, so what I want you to do now, everyone, after watching the two videos, is to bring your science book, open your science book on page 37. So what I want you to do is to sit properly and also to listen carefully. So what are landslides? What are landslides? Let's read what's written over here. I want you everyone to use your pencil to underline the important things that we're going to learn for today. So, let's read together. Landslides. Sometimes an earthquake can cause a landslide. A landslide is a sudden movement of soil or rock from higher to lower ground. Heavy rainfall or snowfall can cause a landslide too. Fast melting snow can also cause a landslide. The soil becomes heavy with water that slides down the hill. So everyone, I want you to underline these lines over here. Okay, so a landslide is a sudden movement of soil or rock from higher to lower ground. So look at the picture everyone and you can see this clearly. So sometimes everyone after the earthquake, and remember the earthquake is a quick shake that happens to the earth's surface, right? And when this happens, some rocks and, let's say, soil will move down, okay, from a mountain or a high place. And sometimes the heavy rainfall or snowfall can cause a landslide too. The fast, or let me say, fast melting snow can cause a landslide because the soil will be heavy with the water that slides down the hill. So the landslide happens because of two or three reasons, let me say. 
The reasons are an earthquake, heavy rainfall, or snowfall. So everyone, I'm going to ask you again, why does the landslide happen? Excellent, because of an earthquake, heavy rainfall, or snowfall. Excellent, everyone. So how do landslides happen? Earthquake may cause landslides, snowfalls may cause landslides, heavy rainfall may cause landslides, and also fast melting snow may cause landslides. So if you look at the picture, you can see why does a landslide happen. So there are four reasons over here. Let's say them one more time. Earthquakes may cause landslides. Okay, so let's say earthquake, snow falls, heavy rain falls, and also fast melting snow. Okay, look at these pictures. These pictures will help you to remember the reason that causes landslides. Okay, so here I want you to move to page 37 and let's read the questions over here. How could an earthquake cause a landslide? So let's read what's written over here. An earthquake might happen on a hill or mountain. When the ground on the hill shakes, the soil could come loose and fall down the hill. So here everyone, as you can, as you can see that, look at the picture. Uh, when the earthquake happens, okay, on a hill or a mountain, the soil will be shaking and also falling down and this will cause a land slide let's read the second question look at the photo circle and effect of the landslide describe what you circled below so as you can see over here there is a circle so i want you everyone also to draw a circle on your book okay over here so the road at the bottom of the hill was blocked as you can see and this is because of the landslides so everyone let's review what we have learned for today a landslide is a sudden movement of soil or rock from higher to lower ground it happens when rocks and soil fall down a hill or a mountain landslides may happen because of earthquakes rainfalls snowfalls or melting snow landslides are also known as land slips landslides can be dangerous they can cause a quick change to earth's landscape they can cause a great damage to roads buildings and plants people and animals also can get hurt okay and here we go everyone task number one I want you to look at these pictures and tell me what do you see. So what do you see everyone? I am going to give you some time. So think about these pictures. Or let me say describe these pictures. So excellent. You can see that the soil or the rocks let's say are moving down from see from a higher to lower place so what do we call everyone these changes excellent we call them landslides landslides okay so we call them landslides and task number two use the link to watch a video then explain what happened so, stop the video for a while, 
or stop my video for a while, click on the link, watch the video and come back. So welcome back. So everyone, heavy rain caused the sudden movement of rocks from higher to lower ground and this is called the landslide. Right? So you have learned today about landslides and how does a landslide happen. So I want you everyone to think about another name for landslides. Excellent, we can call them landslips. And the lesson of today is finished. So have a nice weekend everyone. Bye. See you next week.